hope you guys doing well and uh, today I'm going to show you that uh, how you can install the SAS and uh, watch plugin and uh, generate the style sheet uh, using your SAS so now I'm going to start uh, some SAS code which contains the test file and then also files and uh, now I'm gonna create the uh, development version and production versions files so this is our production version should be dev uh, CSS and then style.css so mm, we can also create a folder here with the name of dev and uh, in the dev folder we also need to create the css folder and then uh, uh, now i'm gonna create the give me a second. now i'm gonna create the style.css file or maybe we do, do not uh, we don't need to create the file it will automatically generate it from uh, the SAS which uh, contain all the uh, code um, using SAS so uh, this is how uh, we can target files this is our production version uh, with the name of dev uh, style uh, CSS and style.css we have created two folders dev and CSS and uh, now I'm gonna create the uh, SRC version which is our development version CSS and then uh, style dot SCSS this is our SAS version and then this is our production version we need to uh, also create the uh, development version with the name of uh, SRC sorry I have uh, we need to add a folder SRC and then within the folder which contains the SAS and styles.css so here we and I have created the SRC uh, SCSS and uh, styles.css uh, which have this pass path and uh, now I'm gonna link the uh, watch plugin watch and then CSS and then files which contain the path of SAS SRC then SCSS and then static static for the folder and uh, this static for subfolder and all target all the SCSS files um, and uh, now we can assign the tasks which have the SAS so uh, we can uh, save this and uh, now I'm gonna load the uh, load those uh, plugins uh, into our uh, load npm task so we need to create the grunt load npm tasks should be grunt contrive and uh, you can also search uh, those plugins in your uh, uh, current uh, plugins directory uh, so you can find the uh, this uh, name so here we have our sas plugin and then uh, grunt dot load npm task should be grunt contrived watch so uh, we have also write the watch here and uh, now I'm gonna install those two plugins 
uh, and uh, run the uh, uh, styles uh, I have created some uh, tags here uh, which can have uh, some kind of uh, variables with the uh, dollar sign should be font size and uh, then 20 px and uh, we can use this variable in here in here so now I'm gonna install go to our term terminal and uh, install those plugins npm install grant contrive uh, and a sas plugin which uh, we need to save and dev save dev uh, npm grant contrive sas save dev and um, after that you need to install the uh, grunt watch plugin grunt uh, sorry uh, npm install grunt contrive contrive watch save dev and uh, here we uh, got our uh, watch plugin So once we install this, uh, we need to run the grunt sas plugin. Sorry, actually, grunt command is not in the src folder, so we need to go back one step. cd dot dot slash yeah so here we got our grunt command and uh, we have run our project so now I'm gonna add grunt says and uh, we need to go to file here it may automatically generate the sas files yes now we have created the sas uh, style.css and, uh, and the map uh, map file should uh, uh, guide you um, while inspecting your uh, uh, browser elements um, so you can got the results exact results here we have created our variable and uh, now we have the mm, sa our style.css is also generated and uh, this is how uh, the style uh, CSS generate the styles using watch uh, once I have create uh, run the grunt and it will automatically watch the watch all our SAS files so for example I'm gonna add some font size uh, font family here uh, it will automatically generate here we have changed the style or CSS it Mm, it will automatically gen again generate the style or CSS so uh, this is how the uh, SAS thing works you can also create the multiple SAS files uh, and um, import uh, with uh, one another and uh, uh, generate the style or CSS in future I will uh, create a a complete website uh, development series so uh, we can also uh, use this SAS thing with the uh, bootstrap SAS 
सो कीप वॉचिंग माई ट्यूटोरियल्स एंड सब्सक्राइब माई चैनल एंड क्लिक द बेल आइकन फॉर गेटिंग माई नोटिफिकेशन फ्राम माई यूट्यूब चैनल सो दैट्स ऑल फॉर नो गाइज होप यू लर्न समथिंग एंड इन्जॉय द डिवेलपमेंट दैट हाउ यू कैन मेक यूर डिवेलपमेंट वेरी फास्ट सो दैट्स ऑल फॉर नाउ and uh, see you guys in my next video which can uh, i can explain about the uh, html generation um, and uh, how to watch html files so that's all for now uh, take care guys